Hi guys, welcome to Mark's Home Kitchen, where I do family friendly recipes that everyone can enjoy. So today's video is for chicken vindaloo. So sit back, relax and enjoy, and thanks for watching. So we're going to take some chicken breast. Now you can use chicken thighs if you want, and we'll just dice it up into about 1 inch pieces. We'll set that to the side where we make our rub. So first of all we get some chilli powder, then some black pepper, some coriander, some turmeric, some cinnamon, some cumin, and some salt. We'll just give that a mix round. We'll pop it over the chicken. Now we'll give that a good mix round, just to make sure all the chicken is covered in the spices. Now we'll cover that with a lid, we'll pop it into the fridge and we'll let it marinate for at least 2 hours or overnight if you have the time. So now that our chicken has been marinated we're going to go over to our cooker, we'll take a medium sized saucepan, we'll pop it onto a medium heat. To that then we're going to add some diced onions, we'll cook those for 15 minutes or so just until they start to soften and go translucent. You don't want them to burn but just to soften. Now that the onions are cooked, we're going to add some crushed garlic, some ginger paste, and then our chicken pieces. We'll fry that for 5 or 10 minutes just until the chicken gets sealed. Now that our chicken is sealed, we're going to start to add the rest of our ingredients. So first of all we start with a tablespoonful of sugar, then some chopped tomatoes, some chicken stock, obviously homemade is best but if not just use a stock cube, some apple cider vinegar, some cardamom pods and finally some tomato puree. Now we'll give that a stir around, we'll leave the lid off and we'll let that simmer for uncovered for about 35 minutes just until the sauce is thickened and it's ready to serve. So as you can see our chicken vindaloo is cooked, I'm just serving mine with some toasted garlic naan bread. So folks if you've enjoyed this video please don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Again thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my further videos.